Output recently dropped their 2.0 version of Arcade. The big new feature is note kits, which allow you to play chords and melodies. And man, am I stoked to check this out with all of you today. Arcade really is one of those cheat code plugins that will jumpstart your songwriting or beat making process every time you sit down to create. And with this 2.0 update, Output really are making a case for Arcade being one of the strongest tools that producers can have in their toolkit. What's going on, my friends? Patrick here. I've been subscribed to Arcade for a couple of years now. I use Arcade regularly, and I really think it's one of the coolest concepts when it comes to working with loops and samples. A brief overview for anybody who is new to Arcade, as Output puts it, Arcade is a new kind of synthesizer. You have a few different kits that you can work with within the Arcade plugin. First, you have sampler kits. These will allow you to trigger and manipulate all kinds of different samples. Next, you have note kits. Again, this is the new feature. Note kits allow you to play chords and melodies using something like your MIDI keyboard. You also have the option to create your own kits, so you can browse through all of the samples in the Arcade sample library, assemble your own kit and play and perform and manipulate those samples the same way you would with a typical sample kit. And you can even bring in your own recordings or your own samples to use within the Arcade plugin. Now, when referring to the sample kits and the note kits, each one of those kits belongs to a different line. And lines essentially group together different kits that fall into the same genre or the same style. You can check out the link in the description below for a free one month trial of Arcade, but I think it's time to dive into Arcade, see what we can cook up. I'm definitely interested in checking out these new note kits, so let's hop in. So Arcade 2.0 should look pretty similar. A few cosmetic upgrades, but you'll also notice down here you have this new section where you get the newest note kits, you get some suggested note kits. And if we open up a random kit, you can see you can now play these just like they were a synth preset. Like with the sampler kits, you have four different effects that you can tweak and play with. It's kind of cool. Very cool. I like this one a lot. If you go up here to tweak, you can mess around with different synthesis parameters. You have a mixer section, you have some different modulation that you can assign, and you have macros for those four different effects that Arcade loads in with whatever kit that you're playing. If you go over here to your lines tab, you can see here output have added in a couple of different icons beneath each line. This little waveform icon will tell you how many sampler kits are in that line, and then the little piano key icon will let you know how many note kits are in that line. So you can see just about all of the lines already have note kits in them. Not all of them, but the way that Output typically updates Arcade, I'm sure before too long all of these lines will have some note kits in them. Dig that for a drum beat. Let's put that in. Now, sometimes I'll separate each one of these samples out. Like this note is our kick sample. This note is our snare sample. This is like a clap sample. But for the sake of time, I'm just gonna bounce this down. Call this beat. And I just like to bounce these out just so I'm working with a waveform as opposed to working with MIDI data. And then I don't have to have like 15 arcade plugins loaded up. Let's see if there's anything else in here that we like. Let me hear that. I think we're good on this kit. Got a nice little drum beat, gonna move on. So this is a kit from the Honey line. Really like Honey, it's like R&B and Neo Soul, good stuff in here.
I like that. I have an idea. We're going to have to chop these samples up a little bit, but just go with me for a second. Okay. So that last little part of that sample, there's a few of those chords that I really like and I have an idea. Let's just see how this sounds. I do dig that bass sound, but I think I'm going to put down the real thing. my friends. I think that's going to do it for today's video. You can see we cooked this up in no time. I'll put Arcade. What more can I say? I really dig it. I use it a lot. Definitely check out that link in the video description for a free month of Arcade. But listen, my friends, until next time, my name is Patrick. I will catch you real soon. All right. Peace.